All right, what's going on friends? In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to change out your cabin air filter on your 2020 Nissan Rogue. And I think this should be real similar with a 2014 to 2020. Um, I will put a link to one of these cabin air filters down in my description and in my first comment. Or just stop at your local auto parts store or Walmart. I think I bought this actually at Walmart. So we're gonna pull this out. And when we pull this out, one thing you're going to want to watch is airflow. This one does not even say the airflow, so maybe it doesn't matter. Oh, yes, it does. Okay, this does right on the end of this. It says airflow that way. So when you pull your old one out, make sure you kind of look at that, see which way the air is flowing, which I think it's flowing that way really anyway, but just to point that out to you. And I'm gonna to try to show you this as good as I can. It's a little cramped up under here, but it's not in your glove box. Like a lot of cars are in your glove box. This one is kind of under your glove box in the center of your car. So I'm just gonna go under my glove box and then right back here. I need a light anyway, but right this little thing. Now I did see, I watched a, another video, somebody doing this. The one video you did have a screw right here. So if you have a screw right there, make sure you take that screw out. This does not seem to have a screw there. So I'm just gonna grab this and there's a clip here and here it should pop right out. Yeah, see that pulls right out. And then there's gonna be spot back in there that should line up and just pop right back in. And right on the top when I put that back in. It's kind of a pain you get out, you'll see it back in there. Should be able to probably just grab this corner, pull down on it like that, and it'll pop out. I don't know why, everybody seemed to have a real hard time getting that out of there. This is the cabin air filter. So I pulled it out like that, saying airflow that way. Well, I guess that's right. Look, this, the dirtiest spot should be the way the air's flowing. So I was wrong in the beginning, it's going that way. So I gotta put this one on. Yeah, I gotta put that one on so the air arrow is fading, facing toward the back of the car. Now, see if I can slide that up in there. I may end up, I may end up having to kind of crush this down a little like that to get it in there. It's a little tricky, I think. As you can't see nothing. That go up. Here we go. I just had to lift up the bottom to get it started in there. And it kind of starts going in. And it popped up in there now. And move it around. I think it's in there, yep. There's a, there's, a piece, there's a part at the top that you kind of have to get around. So once it hits that top, you got to push up in on the bottom, up in there to get it started. It's really, really hard to show you that. There, yep. at least putting that on is easy. All right, well, I hope this helped you with replacing your cabin air filter. Give this video a thumbs up. Please leave me a comment down below. Let me know how that went. Did it Was it a pain in the butt? Or was it easier? Did I help you out at all? Or just tell me thank you. Hit that subscribe button to help support my channel. God bless and have a great day.